We're now going to take a look at the correlations that can be used to determine the convective heat transfer coefficient for internal pipe flow. And we're going to begin with the two correlations for laminar flow. So we'll begin with a case of laminar pipe flow fully developed and we're assuming uniform heat transfer, constant heat flux, and this is for a parental number greater than 0 0.6. So we get a simple expression uh, for the new salt number based on diameter. Now another case that we could have, again laminar fully developed, So this is the case where we have a uniform wall temperature and for this case the new salt number based on diameter is 3.66 and in both of these equations the properties for the thermal conductivity evaluated at T mean or T bulk. So that's the mean or bulk temperature. All right, so that is uh, two sets of equations that you can use if you have laminar pipe flow, either constant heat flux or constant wall temperature.